Zelensky says Ukraine is losing 60 to 100 soldiers a day. US announces new military aid package for Ukraine worth $700 million. It includes long-range HIMARS rockets and other high-tech military equipments. Ukraine's first lady tells news that giving up land is like conceding a freedom. Jerusalem Post defeats China's threats to downgrade relations with Israel if it doesn't pull interview with Taiwan leader. The story ain't going anywhere, said editor-chief. U.S. lifts Cuba flight restrictions imposed under Trump. Taiwan restricts Russia, Belarus to CPUs under 25 MHz frequency. Brazilian soccer icon Pele calls on Putin to stop wicked Ukraine invasion. A Russian soldier who didn't want to fight in Ukraine and went into hiding. After fleeing his post says none of us wanted this war. Finland becomes world's first country to make legally binding carbon negativity pledge. China urges UN rights chief to look into school shootings in US. WHO believes COVID getting worse, not better in North Korea. Canada alarmed as Chinese fighter pilots bus Canadian planes over international waters national. UN registers Turkey as new country named to replace Turkey. Putin treated for cancer in April, U.S. intelligence report says. A Russian journalist is auctioning off his Nobel Peace Prize medal to raise funds for Ukrainian refugees. Taliban eradicating Afghanistan's poppy cultivation to wipe out opium and heroin production.